I'm calling the nail salon because I'm going to show you in a second. Your call cannot. Okay, it's whatever. But I got my nails done as you saw in the last vlog I did. Thursday, it's only been five days. This nail was already peeled off completely. Because in school today, I noticed it was like peeling up and like it was halfway peeled up. And I was like, okay, I'm not gonna touch with it. I'm not gonna mess with it. I was putting my jacket on because it was like cold. My whole nail peeled off. And I got it done five days ago and it's supposed to last for mm, seven days, uh, seven days to 14 days. So I'm gonna go call them. I was gonna call them and ask them if, um, if, they, if they could redo it or like give me a refund or something because that's not acceptable at all. Guess what? My Carly Bible palette came. So my Carly Bible palette came in the mail and Chelsea's filming for me. And I'm about to open it. Here's what it looks like. It has plastic over it. You got any keys? Up there by my TV. Oh man, I oh, think that's that your man. I hate the DM. Oh, I think I messed it up. Let's see. I'm not sure, wait. Yeah, I think it's part of it. Hopefully not, but it's whatever. Ooh, my can I Bible. use that? Yeah. Let me see it. <gasps> Whoa. It's twelve fifty plus shipping and handling um, on BH Cosmetics. And I'll show you guys better lighting in my room. So I got new light bulbs in my room, so um, they're daylight, daylight. So now the quality probably looks a lot better or a lot more true to color. So I'm gonna show you guys this palette again. So I can show you. And I also realized why I wanted this for Valentine's Day. I'll show you in a second. So that's a little better. So these are four highlighted shades. I tried this one, this one's way too dark. I was like, oh, that one will match. So like these two together are my perfect shade or just this one. These two up here are perfect for Valentine's Day. This is like a deep moon and that's like a purple, light purple. And then the rest are just, you know, <laughs> this seems like the perfect crease color. I'm super excited about this palette. Might use it tomorrow. Not still when we're makeup tomorrow, but we'll see since I got this new palette. Hey guys, no, I did that. Um, I'm currently making ramen. And la if you guys watched my Snapchat yesterday, and I was excited to make it, and I found out that at this grocery store, I got a cup and noodle, beef cup and noodles instead of ramen, and I hate cup and noodles, so I found some in the can pantry. I guess it's my dad's girlfriend, so I'm making that. No, it's unhealthy. I just had ramen yesterday too, but it was nasty because it was chicken, and I don't know where I put my phone or my wallet. Look, I don't know. I have. Oh, here it is. Okay. Never mind, found it. But I thought when I'm waiting, I thought why not when I'm waiting to cover this song that I've been loving. Um, I'm not a singer like I've said before. Um, if I suck, I don't care. You guys can tell me in the comments, but this is just something, you know, for the memories and something I can look back on and be like, wow, Ashley, my battery's running low. And wow, Ashley, you really sucked at singing. Why'd you do that? So um, it's called uh, on the outside looking in by Jordan Fruitt. I love it. I'm gonna charge my camera a little bit before I film and I'll actually actually I'm gonna film on my DSLR just because this is dying so I'm gonna charge this and Yeah, so I'm super excited about this cover and you guys will hear it. If you don't like it You guys can tell me down below. Um, I'm not a perfect singer and I wish I could play the guitar But I'm actually looking at the instrumental on YouTube. So let's get it Back. You don't know how it feels to be outside the crowd you don't know what it's like to be left out And you don't know how it feels to be a home best friend On the outside looking in I'm sick of wasting all my time Pause, because Chelsea's calling me Hello guys, I'm actually about to cook dinner very, very soon. It's currently 5.05 .05 and I think I'm gonna cook dinner at 5.30. Tonight we're having Monterey chicken, which is like chicken with barbecue sauce and cheese on top. And then aside with that, we have um, mashed potatoes. I never cooked it before, but I have an idea of cooking it. I think I've helped before, so I'm excited. I may or may not vlog about it. I may not vlog me cooking it, but yeah. That's what's happening in this moment.
January 7th and I'm chilling at home I'm about to watch some YouTube videos I could probably do homework first but I don't feel like it so I'm not but for my snack I have right now it's like 4 four ten maybe for my snack I have a delicious smoothie and some cup and noodles these are beef flavored and I think in my vlog maybe I put it on snack I hate cup and noodles but I normally hate chicken cup and noodles, and I hate chicken ramen as well. Well, I don't hate it, I just don't like it. So, I'm going to try the beef cup and noodles, and I might have to be, I might be forced my, I might force myself to eat them, because, you know, you got to do what you got to do, but hopefully these are good. And I'll vlog my experience. I'm so excited this week went by actually surprisingly so fast, and I'm so happy because, like, tomorrow's Friday. Like, what? Like, this week went by really fast, so... Also on Saturday I have a study date. Not really a study date. I'm not sure what's called a study date with these girls and you are interested in boys, but um it's with these two girls that I like know but I'm not friends with them. So I'm not sure. And I'm not smart in English class, so we'll see about that. But it's fine because I have an 86 in English. The other girl says a 91 and then the other one is failing. <laughs> not sure if it's clever to be in a study group with people that are failing. But whatever, she still has some knowledge. It's not bad. I think the reason why I don't like it is because the noodles are like harder. They're well, not as soft as ramen noodles. And so I made a new insulate. And it is so good. Also, I painted my nails again. They were like this tan color. And like the nail polish was disgusting. And it would chip like literally in an hour. So not even. So I painted it this beautiful purps color. And so are my toes down there. I suck at painting my nails, but they don't look too bad. And this gold color is gel nail, and it's, um, damn like that. Since I got my nails done, and that's the only nail that stayed on. Here it is. It's showing up different a lot in camera, but basically, here I got my social media, and then I got my Ashley Nicole promo, and then the video in the iMac. I used to think about over here putting videos in the iMac. I am zooming in. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I totally did not make it up. I totally got so much inspiration from Image Johansson. Her videos are awesome, so go check her out. I know I've completely copied her. I just got finished journaling, and I think that doing stuff like this, or like spending a couple minutes to yourself, is, is really needed in the everyday life. And honestly, I mean, obviously, I'm not gonna show you my journal because it's very personal, and I just kind of let my feelings out and just kind of wrote what came to mind. I'm gonna flash at it. That's all you get if you paused it and it was upside down and you can read it. Good for you, but yeah, I'm really happy with what I wrote today. I'm not going to write every day. I'm going to try and make an effort to write at least every um, every week. And this journal already has like some YouTube video ideas in it, but it's fine. I just kind of started from another one. I'm going to label them and see how many journals I have. So this was journal number one of 2016, so I'm super pumped about these. And I think I'm gonna put it right by my bedside table so that I can journal every day. So it's gonna be right here next to Joey's book because I was reading that the other day. What up, peeps? Today is Friday, January 8th. And today I'm gonna turn on my light so y'all can see. We are about to go to the gym. This is my first time going to the gym with Chelsea. We just got home from school, so I literally have my D's on. But I'm about to pick up my outfit. I'm super excited. Don't know what to wear. I'll show you guys my outfit when I'm done. I'm gonna film some stuff at the gym too. I think we're just gonna do cardio because I just kind of like cardio. So I think I might wear this top. I only have like, the only, I only have one pair of leggings and they're like um purple and that won't match. So we'll figure it out. So here's my outfit. It's super duper simple. I actually felt my black ones. I forgot I had these. I mean I knew I had. I forgot I had them. And they weren't lost. I just looked at my drawer and I couldn't find my purple ones. And I was like, wait, I have black ones. I forgot about these. So these are just black. Um, I don't know what the length is called. Then I got on my ugly shoes. Like these don't match my outfit at all, but I don't care. And then this cute coral top and my hair is a pony. Hey, 
yo, tonight is the night that I'ma get twisted. Mix Moscato and vodka, I'ma mix it. Roll that spaceship, we about to get lifted. Live in the present, that gift is for the gifted. This what you came, this what you came for. You get what you buy, this what you pay for. So make sure the stars is what you aim for. Make mistakes, though. So we just got out of the gym. I didn't film too much because I didn't, like, I put my camera down and there's this man, if you saw, working out next to me. I didn't want him to feel intimidated by it because he saw it, I think. And he was just like, oh, I don't want to work out by this. So I didn't want to keep it out for too long, but I just wanted to show you guys some stuff that we did. Didn't do all of that stuff. Um, I mean, didn't do just that. Like, I did the treadmill and some leg machines and then, but I showed you and that's about it. So um, now we're going home and we're going to have some dinner and we might make a smoothie. And it's not like said I'm starving. It's not like said make a movie. And we might make a smoothie. I always do like I, when I was making my video, my voice for one of my videos. I said total strudels. I was talking way too fast. It's 5:51. School got out at 3:30. We probably came here at well, we got there at four. So been in there for about two hours. And now we're on our way home. And my arm hurts from holding my camera. So I'll see y'all later. So I don't think that I vlogged actually saying that I was home. But I've been home for a while now, and I always end my vlogs when I, I'm ready for bed because I forget to end them any other time. So I'm sorry in the last vlog. My computer's been making that weird sound, and I hate it. Like, I need to get a new computer ASAP because this one is getting on my nerves. But I wanted the same. Um, I didn't end my last vlog, which I'm so sorry. It was just like a split cutoff or whatever it's called. Um, I just it cut off and it was like, was that the end? <laughs> I'm sorry. So I'm gonna end this vlog. Not sure of how many days this was. I think it's just this school week. But tomorrow is an exciting day. The vlog may or may not be up tomorrow. It depends on how much footage I get. But I'm doing the study and I might be hanging out with my friend Destiny. I hope we are, but I'm not sure. So I just packed my bag and I have all my school stuff in it. And yeah, we're going to Starbucks and then Destiny and I are going out to eat and we like walk around um, at the mall. So um, I'll see y'all whenever, whenever that vlog will go up, so peace.